In this video, we quickly cover the news that Church's Chicken in Venezuela just started accepting cryptocurrency Dash. How does this affect cryptocurrency adoption in Venezuela and does this influence the rest of the world? This report covers a meaningful and interesting topic, so do watch to the end of this video to understand more. Hello YouTube, how is everyone doing? As of recent, the crypto markets seem to be embracing a coming capitulation. For this reason, some traders and investors seem to be happy, while some are anxiously sad. Which category of investors are you? We need to evaluate and reflect on ourselves. What emotions should we be embracing now? As most experts say, in this bear market now, it's time when the dumb money or weak hands leave while the smart money or strong hands come in. If you are in the category of smart money, then congratulations. Because if you are happy now that you see this bearish market as an opportunity, I would say you will be making huge gains very soon as the market consolidates and go into a bullish market later on. If you do not believe me, well, do look at the Bitcoin and crypto markets from a macro perspective and you will see that the Bitcoin price has always gone very bullish after a bear correction of possibly 90%. The type of bull that I'm referring to are past Bitcoin gains of well over 10,000% as illustrated in this simple chart. Nevertheless, let's not focus on just the price in this video. Instead, let's look at positive news such as this latest cryptocurrency adoption news such as what I'm about to share with you. Church's Chicken, a universal fast food establishment, has purportedly joined forces with Dash Venezuela to convert the primary drive through food establishment to acknowledge digital forms of money or cryptocurrency all through its different Venezuelan residential regions. As indicated in a public statement, a vital correlation between Dash Venezuela and Church's Chicken Venezuela will see 13 of such chains begin accepting this cryptocurrency as customer payment. This is possible as the management staffs at Church's completed their training to understand the digital cryptocurrency. Church's Chicken is the fourth largest chicken drive through food chain on the planet as it has 1,700 eateries spread all through 25 nations. This establishment's delegates in Venezuela are hoping to advance the cryptocurrency as a major aspect of the move. Orlando Nayas, the Chief General of Church's Chicken Venezuela, highlighted that he buckled down with the support gathering to diligently prepare the establishment's staff to acknowledge customers' payments in the form of the cryptocurrency. He also mentioned that this move demonstrates that he believes the adoption of cryptocurrency Dash is important and that Church's Chicken will end up being an advanced operator in this new financial world. Bradley Zastro, the worldwide executive of business development at Dashcore, remarked the development is a fantastic job, in quotes, which empowers the digital currency's development in Venezuela. This, he says, the church's chicken adoption is, open quote, energizing and exciting, close quotes. Relating to this report, there was news that KFC Venezuela is accepting Dash. This is declared untrue by Antonio Sampaya, the CEO of KFC Venezuela. He uncovered that the KFC Venezuela chain isn't accepting Dash payment at this point of time. Dash Merchant Venezuela, an association advancing the crypto's adoption in the nation, later on tweeted out an open statement of regret to KFC Venezuela. Now, for the crypto meme for the day. Ah, ha, ha. Oh, that's hot. That's hot. Brace yourself.
We hope you have enjoyed this latest blockchain and cryptocurrency news. If you have enjoyed it, please smash the like button and leave a comment of what you think about this cryptocurrency adoption news. Until the next video, report. Cheers. Blockchain 360. Blockchain 360.